What amazes me about artists is how they bear themselves to the world, reach someone who needs it most, and lead that person into realizing that they're not alone. I sing in both Kosa and English, which I call Konglish. Fame started for me from when I was six months as an Edgar's catalog baby. My mother was a jazz backing vocalist. My cousins were quite good music dancers. My brother was a hip hop producer. The music I could not escape. I call my sound feature ghetto funk. As a child, I suffered from eating disorders. There's a belief that black people don't get eating disorders. I was never hiding it until I started realizing it's wrong. But then after my mom's death, I didn't know how to feel. So I just had to stop, try to take charge. I am about owning sexuality and owning your body and celebrating it. I want women to have a voice in the bedroom, to speak and say, this is how I want it, this is how I won't take it. If you feel offended by things like that, you shouldn't be engaging because you can be a rabbit on your own and the woman can sit there and lay there like a fried chicken. You want to be saying, hey, I matter. My hair, it's a moon mop. It's one of those things where you either like it or hate it, but you're going to definitely pay attention to it. Both the love I've received locally and internationally blows my mind.